Now, the most live local talk with Melody Burns. Okay, it's 407. This is my favorite Christmas song right here. This is called My Favorite Time of Year. Uh, this song, the Florence Street Band put together last year. And uh, this year they have a new song. I haven't heard it yet. I am uh, extremely anxious to hear this song. But joining us now from across the pond is uh, Lee Hagward. Hey, Lee, how are you? Hello there. How are you doing? I'm good. You know, I love last year's song, My Favorite Time of Year. How are you going to top it? Ah, uh, <laughs> a challenging one. But I think I may have... I think I may be able to match it at least. <laughs> you, you think so? Okay, so this year's song is The Winter Wonder, right? Yep. Yep, it's an upbeat song, so it's kind of different from the other one. It's a bit more upbeat and a bit of a party song, but lots of really strong melodies in it. So I think the song definitely can match it. I think the video is going to be more of a challenge because obviously that video is so beautiful. So oh, yeah. That's the challenge of this one. It's, it's getting the video to look sort of magical as well, you know? So. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I, and, I, you know, the thing about my favorite time of year is um, it is such a traditional Christmas song, and, yeah, the, and yeah. the video really adds to that whole feeling. Exactly, yeah. Well, yeah. that's what I mean. When, when I wrote the song, I, I really wanted to try and incorporate kind of all the traditional elements, like the, the choir and string section and sort of carol singers and stuff, you know. And, yeah, really do something that's got a nice melody, really, and, and uh, yeah, capture the magic of Christmas. And Well, you did. Happens. Yeah, well, I, and I was so lucky as well because so many talented people helped make the video and... The whole thing became a very, very sort of special, sort of magical thing. And I think partly because so much goodwill went into it, you know, and people just seem to really enjoy it all over the world. So that's mm-hmm. great. Yeah, yeah. Well, and now we're, you're trying to do that again this year with the Winter Wonder. And yeah. uh, I saw your notice yeah, because you did what you did last year. You're out there reaching out to people. Uh, you're trying to get everybody to help you produce the video, <laughs> um, which is great. And we can actually help you do that like we did last year. Um, yeah. So how can we do that, Lee? What's because we're here and you're over there across the pond. How can we help over here in America? Well, there's this new phenomenon called crowdfunding, which is um, it's for like creative projects. And the idea is that you set a target that you want to reach money-wise, yeah. and you offer the, um, a reward for pledging. So, for example, in our case, if you spend you know five, you get a signed CD, and then twenty pounds, it's a, a prop or something from the set, and in this case, for 200, you can be in the video in full Victorian costume. So we've got, we've got 40 of those. We've already got a few people flying over from America to be in it, actually. Oh, do you? Um, yeah, nice. believe it or not. Um, yeah, so that's the way we're doing it, to try and reach our goal. And the idea being that we have two weeks, I think, to try and re- get the money. Otherwise, you don't get any of it. So. <laughs> oh, well, okay. So you're try- and you want to produce the video like December 8th or something? Is that right? Is yeah, that the December idea? the 8th. It's all booked. Um, Everything is in, in place for the afternoon of December the 8th. And, uh, yeah, it's a beautiful medieval barn just outside Bath in, in, in the west of England, which is like a historic city. Mm-hmm. Um, really, really beautiful. We've got all these crew on standby. I mean, basically, we've got loads of people ready to go, a good hundred odd people <laughs> ready to go on this production. And, and, uh, and we're hoping to, like, yeah, like I say, to get everybody to support us. Because, obviously, Victorian videos aren't easy to make. You know, right. I've, cho- I've chosen a difficult one. <laughs> Yeah, it was gonna, era. well, yeah. but the last one, I mean, last year is, you know, my favorite time of year, Victorian also, but, um, yeah. you know, it was the costumes and the whole scenery and stuff, and now you're going to try and pull this off for a second year. Well, the thing is, we actually did that video a couple of years ago, actually. Yeah. You know, I, I re-released it last year, which I will do every year. Mm-hmm. Um, so, yeah, it was a few years ago, and I, I need to add more stuff to Florence Street, because obviously you should wait a few years before we do anything, but everybody says, oh, are you going to do some more? You know, are you going to do more Christmas songs, you know, we love this, can we have an old album, you know, yeah. so it seems to make sense that, you know, if I'm going to do it, I need to do it, you know, properly, with the same kind of magic sprinkled all over it. Oh, so yeah, very, very I would talented. love a full, I would love a full album, because, yeah. you know, like I said, and I, I've sent I, my favorite time of year around to everybody, I was doing it last year, yeah, cool. and you know, I started doing it again this year, so they know they could at least get a flavor. Since you, you're not giving us any insight into the new one. Ah. <laughs> I was hoping you'd give us a teaser. Um, oh, well, funnily enough, actually, I'm going to upload a clip of it um, next week, actually. Oh, you are? Okay. Yeah, yeah, for all our different 
outlets. Yeah, yeah, because I'm, I'm actually recording the song as we speak. Yeah, nice. <laughs> so, okay. Um, and yeah, definitely. So how can we hear that? How do we get that? Um, well, there'll be a clip on our Facebook page, which is Facebook slash Florence Street. Yeah. And uh, it'll be on our website, probably on YouTube as well. It's just, it's just a, a taster to get, so you can get the feel of it. With We have like the crowd ambience and the general atmosphere, because it's a very, very upbeat kind of river dance style song. It's, it's quite Celtic sounding, and it's quite... There's a, there's a, there's a, a fiddle solo and a tap dance sequence and all kinds of stuff in the middle of it. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, good. Yeah. But, but it's going to have that traditional... I mean, like the real Christmas feel to it. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah, because that's what you do with my favorite time of year. When And the thing about that song is when you put... Um, you know, you get that feeling, but you cannot, You also get a nice little, like it hangs with you for a little bit. It doesn't go away. It stays right there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, you know, as, as a songwriter, it's kind of, sometimes you get these, these gems and they just come from somewhere else. It's, it's, it's kind of a, it's a magical thing, you know, and mm-hmm. you sit there at the piano tinkling away for ages and eventually you find an idea and it kind of develops. And that's what happened with that song. It was something quite special, really, because it just sounds like it was meant to be. You know? Yeah, right. It really, really pleased with it. So. I think it's always going to be a challenge to kind of write songs in that style that match up, because obviously you can't rewrite the same song over and over again, you know what I mean? Um, so this is why I've gone for something that's quite different, but still very melodic, still, you know, the kind of thing that I write, which is I, I do love my big sweeping melodies and, you know, sure. string sections and, you know, so this has got some great tunes in it, so I think, I think you'll like it. Oh, good. All right, well, I trust your job. Let's explain to people why you're doing this now. You're not tied to any big label, any big company. Uh, you're just trying to do this on your own, Correct. That's right, yeah. I, I, um, I just love... In the UK, you know, we used to have a tradition of people release Christmas records, and when I was a child, it was so exciting to look forward to the Christmas charts. But nowadays, we don't have that at all anymore. It's all, it's all show winners and, and protest songs. So we, we've lost that, and I think children miss that now, you know, and nobody really bothers anymore. So I contacted the record companies and asked if they'd be interested in backing the project, and they just said, there's no market for it, so mm-hmm. we're not going to do it. So... I kind of went away for a while, and then I realized, actually, in this day and age, you can do it yourself, you know? Sure. So, so I, with the help of YouTube and things like that, so I eventually managed to find lots of people that were willing to help and, um, you know, use what savings I had to fund it. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah, you know, that's, it all kind of went from there. And, of course, you know, because it's been so popular and it's been used now for all sorts of things in the UK and it's been, you know, like I say, US underperforming. Right. Lots of, yeah, lots of people playing it in their school productions. It's brilliant. And so... It kind of shows that people do love this stuff, and there is a market for it. Yeah. And, you know, we've got to keep going, which is why I really want to do the Winter Wonder and, and get some more songs out there, you know? So, sure. So yeah. we can help by going to crowdfunding? Well, basically, oh. I've... Yeah, it's on the... I mean, it's all on our Facebook slash Flying Street page. Oh. Type the winterwonder.com into your browser. Mm-hmm. That's the com. It redirects to our, our crowd page, so you'll see the little promo video that explains it all, and... Mm-hmm. It's a little button you can press to sort of pledge and stuff. And, yeah, so that's the winterwonder.com, and that goes straight there. Oh, great. Well, we'll, we'll try it that way um, yeah, yeah. because I get a, a, a to actually hear some music that is uh, real Christmas music, not some of this garbage that's being out there now. So, yeah, you know, this really, really is nice to listen oh, to. I'm, I'm so glad that you support it. I really, really appreciate it. Are you kidding? I love it. And we're actually going to use... Um, my favorite time of year. We're producing a video. Or a, what we've done is we've collected thirty thousand Christmas cards for our troops to send overseas, wow. and yeah. we try. We've collected pictures of people signing the cards and you know saying Merry Christmas. And we're going to use that song, my favorite year, yeah. as our background. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> so that'll be that'll be pasted. We're going to use that to our Facebook page, Christmas cards for our troops. 2013, and I'll send you that link so you'll see where it is and what we've done with your song. Oh, fantastic, yeah. I'll post that as well on my page. Please. Yeah, cool. Oh, it's great. Well, Thank listen, you. all right, we will check it out, and uh, yeah. I can hardly wait to hear the new song, The Winter yeah. Wonder. And in the meantime, we can go, um, you know, we can go to your website. Uh, yeah. We can also go to Facebook. It's the Florence Street Band, and yeah. uh, a little more information. But right. keep us in the loop and let us know how you turn out with this one. Yeah, absolutely. I'll keep you posted on it, and uh, it's, it's, it's all looking very exciting, so... Yeah, yeah. Posted, so. it is. It's great. All right. Yeah. Thank you, my friend. Take care. Yeah. Thank you very much. Oh, my pleasure. Yeah. Take care. OK. The song you can listen to now and we played a little bit in the opening uh, was my favorite time of year. We'll play it again in a minute um, so you can hear that. But it's called my favorite time of year. You can get it on uh, YouTube. It's by the Florence Street Band. Now, I I liked it because it was very traditional. 
Uh, and I, I just, you know, I like the strings and I like everything that's going on. But if you can get it from YouTube, you can actually watch the video that goes with it, which is fantastic. And that's what we're talking about with Lee is they're producing a video that goes with a new song, The Winter Wonder. And so because they are independents, they need to raise money to do that. And you can help them, uh, you know, by checking their page out, thewinterwonder.com, and you can uh, listen to that. Uh, you know, like you said, he's going to upload some of the new one. I can hardly wait to hear it. But that's what we'll do. And uh, we helped him last year. Here it is. This is uh, my time of year. And last year's song. And, yeah, the U.S. Army Band liked this song so much that they played it. They adopted it and played it. So, yeah. Pretty cool. All right, we're going to do a little bit of traffic and weather. It's 418. We'll be back in just a few minutes on Talk 1300.